I don't know what to say about this guy anymore, man. Like, have we ever seen a quarterback like this before? Like what? Well, it, it, we've unpredictable, seen plenty of quarterbacks not work out, but the um, the highs are so high. When when he makes a play, it's like, holy shit, he might be the greatest player that's been here since Walter Payton. Jay Cutler. And, and that... I'm just saying Jay made unbelievable throws. He made right? unbelievable throws. He had a throw, howitzer yeah. for an arm, and then there were times where he'd throw it right to the D-tackle, and you're like, what the hell are you looking at? And then he'd come after the game and go, you th- you don't know what you're looking at. You think you do. But I... And but... It, but <laughs> But I feel like the moments with Cutler were still like, oh, there's your Cuddy moment. You know, and like with Fields, it's it, I don't know that we have a clear answer at how much the coaching's holding him back. Because one week it's like, oh, this is perfect game plan for him. And then the next it's like, what are they doing? And why can't you get rid of the ball? The, look, let's just keep it basic, all right, for a second. Okay, I'm sorry. He I'm, is He is inconsistent. All right. Yeah, that's fair. I mean that okay. He he can look great and he can look not great. The uh, and now how much of that is 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 the offense and what's being schemed, but the wild swings from just incredible football play to he was going to struggle if he had stayed in the game to get to 150 yards today. Like you it is hard to build a consistent winning offensive formula team when you are riding the roller coaster as hard as the Bears are riding it. 